4 tablespoon chia seeds Drops of vanilla extract A teaspoon of honey Vita soy chocolate flavor Mix well Cover and in refrigerate for one hour or overnight Top with raisins, cocoa nibs, sliced mango I'm using one and a half cups of chia seeds. Now for the milk, you can choose any. It can be soy milk, almond milk, skim milk, or full cream milk. Now let's mix it a bit. Let's add some vanilla extract. Mix it well, close the lid, and let it sit for a few minutes in the fridge. And my favorite part is adding the toppings. We have some mango, dried berries, and some cookie crunch. So there you go. It's super easy, healthy, negosha recipe that you can make at home. And just close the lid. Make sure you have a nice packaging. Place some label or sticker on top. I hate chia seeds. They get stuck in your digestive tract, stuck in your teeth, and that chia seed pudding texture, ooh. But I've got a trick to solve that. Blend it, baby. Now you've got a creamy, chocolatey texture that reminds me of a silken pie. It tastes best chilled, topped with a little coconut cream or Greek yogurt with a dash of cacao nibs. This is a game changer. If you make it, comment below and let me know what you think. Okay, you guys, today I'm gonna to be mixing up my oatmeal with chia seeds, flax seeds, blueberries, things that are superfoods, have tons of benefits. They're gonna help with things like heart disease, diabetes, cancer, digestive disorders, hormone imbalances, immune support. They're packed full of antioxidants, great anti-inflammatory, packed with protein, super filling, lots of energy and full of fiber. So definitely recommend giving it a try. Enjoy. 
Thank you for watching Foodie. Subscribe for more.